Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today and welcome back to League 2 Predictions. Um, obviously the weekend's just passed, I will uh, recap on the results um, and what I think of um, both sides of the results from both sets of teams. Um, guys, don't forget this, t this video is sponsored by LOL T-Shirt Company. Um, I'd like to thank you for all the constant support they've been showing me in my videos. Um, if you didn't know, the part of the deal that I've done with the LOL T-Shirt Company is they've agreed to do my first lot of merch. The uh, links for all my merch is down in the description below. But guys, you know what I do. So guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and let's go. So the first guy I'll kick off with is Carlisle versus Forest Green. Um, Carlisle beating Stevenage 3 2 away from home. Forest Green beating Colchester 1 0 at home. Both results probably with the odds in both sets of games. Um, Forest Green, I'll probably expect a little bit more than the 1 0 result, but you got the three points, which all that matters. But as far as this game goes, I'll go for a 3 0. 3-0 for a screen win for that one. Um, the next one is Cheltenham Town versus Bradford. Bradford beating Walsall away 1-0. And Cheltenham Town beating Salford 2-0 away from home. Both um, good three points. Bradford I was probably expecting Cheltenham Town Obviously, all teams have to go out there and fight for the points, which is, you know, true in every uh, shape of the game of football. Um, but probably Chatham Town is probably the best three points out of the two games. Um, no disrespect to Bradford, just probably expecting you to beat Walsall. And Chatham to do our Salford, you know, it's probably a bit more... Surprising, um, but as far as this game goes, I've gone for a one-all scoreline for that one. My next one is Crawley Town versus Plymouth Argyle. Crawley Town beating Mansfield one 0 at home. Plymouth Argyle losing surprisingly to Port Vale one 0 away from home. A great three points for Port Vale. Um, Plymouth, on the other hand, you know, weren't such good at the office. Crawley um, losing, you know, the last few games, you know, over the past few weeks. So, a great three points for Crawley to get back on terms. Um, but it's got to keep it up. Uh, but as far as the result goes, I've gone for a 2 0 Crawley Town win. My next one is Exeter City versus Port Vale. Exeter drawing 2 2 with Lake Norian at home. Great point for Lake Norian. Um, Paul Fell beat, yeah, I just literally spoke about them. Um, beating Plymouth 1 0 at home. Great three points for Paul Fell. Much against the odds in that game. Uh, 2 2 uh, for Exeter. Disappointing point away uh, at home. But a great point for Lake Norian, and I'll speak about that in just a minute. But as far as this game goes, I'll go for a 3 2 Exeter Town, uh, Exeter City win. My next one is Lake Norian versus Crew Alexander. As I've just said, great point for Lake Norian, um, you know, in all honesty. Um, you know, coming back up from the conference, I think they're doing a great job back in League Two. Um, it's never easy to come back up from the conference and to hold your own, which I think that Norman is doing okay at this stage of the season. Um, Crew Alexander losing 3 2 at home to Cambridge. You know, that's probably a bit of a disappointment. No disrespect to Cambridge whatsoever. Um, but as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 1 all scoreline for that one. My next one is Macclesfield versus Newport. 
Newport losing 2 0 away to Northampton Town. Macclesfield losing 3 0 away from home to Swindon Town. Um, you know, both teams not pick up any points this weekend. Probably more disappointed on the Newport County end of the results because of where Newport are, and I know what Newport can do. Um, Macclesfield, yeah, you could be a bit downhearted, but you're away to Swindon Town, you know, who have been in League 2 and League 1 for quite a while now, so I know what to expect. Um, but, but as far as the game goes, I've gone for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Mansfield versus Cambridge. Um, Mansfield losing 1 0 away to Crawley Town. Cambridge 3 2 winners over Crew Alexander away from home. What a great three points for Cambridge. Um, you know, as I said when I speak about that Crew result, you know, with Crew, you know, I'll probably be a bit disappointed if I was a Crew Alexander fan. On the other end of being a Cambridge fan, I would absolutely be delighted with the three points. Um, but as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 2-1 Cambridge win. My next one is Morecambe versus Walsall. Walsall losing 1-0 at home to Bradford. Morecambe losing 3-0 to Scunthorpe away from home. I ain't going to talk about that. Actually, I will talk about our Morecambe result, come to think of it. Disappointing result, especially not to get a goal either. Uh, hard that at the office for Morecambe. Exactly the same thing for Walsall. Um, but your plan, Bradford, you know, could slightly be expected. But as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 0 0 scoreline for that one. My next one is Salford City versus Grimsby. Um, Salford City losing 2 0 at home to Cheltenham. You know, fair enough because of where Salford came from. Grimsby Town 2 2 at home to Oldham Athletic. Yeah, I don't quite know how to sum that up if I'm all honest. Um, but as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 3 1 Grimsby Town win. The next one is at Scunthorpe versus Oldham Athletic. Just as we spoke about the two. Um, Scunthorpe winning 3 0 at home against Morecambe. Oldham Athletic 2 2 against Grimsby Town. Great point for Oldham at home. Great three points for Scunthorpe. Gone for, you know, considering the last few results. Um, but as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 2 1 scoreline for that one to Scone for. Um, the next one is Stevenage versus Northampton Town. Northampton Town beating Newport County at home 2 0. Stevenage beating. Uh, so he loses to Carlisle 3-2 at home. New, uh, Northampton Town, what a great three points for Northampton Town. Carlisle, uh, Stevenage, sorry, you know, probably a bit expected. No disrespect to Stevenage. But as far as this game goes, I've gone for a 3-0 Northampton Town win. My last one for this weekend is Swindon Town versus Colchester. Colchester losing 1 0 away to Forest Green. Swindon Town beating Macclesfield 3 0 at home. This is going to be a very interesting game, but I've gone for a 3 0 Swindon Town win. But, guys, you know what you know what to do, so give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.